Hey guys. So yeah, just out in nature again. One of my favorite places. Um, but anyway, you might hear some birds chirping and some frogs croaking and see some rabbits running around in the background. Um, I'm just out at one of my favorite places, a beautiful lake and just, um, but I want to share some Bible verses with you. I uh, sometimes um, just go for a ride on my motorcycle and um, I just backpack and bring a drink and snacks and stuff like that and uh, my notebook. And um, so I just was, you know, thinking about God and just kind of talking to God. And I was like, okay, what do you want to show me tonight? Like, what do you want me to read? So um, I just got on my phone. I have the Bible app. It's called Version. It's amazing. Like you can just search any word and it'll bring up all the Bible verses with that word in it. So you pick different topics. Um, there's little Bible plans, uh, little devotions that you can do. Some are five days, some are seven days, just not even five minutes out of your day, guys. It's just amazing and encouragement to help you get through your day. Um, yeah, but it's a really great app and there's a daily verse that you can get every day on there. Um, you know, just read it, meditate on it for a little bit, say a prayer. Hey, you know, um, it's just great to meet with God every day. He just really helps, um, helps me get through my day. So, uh, but that's kind of what I was looking up is, you know, there's a song that's called Shoulders. Um, it's by For King and Country. And I actually sang that song at my dad's Celebration of Life service, um, July 3rd of um, 2015. And um, it, it just really became a song of strength uh, for me and my family and um, an encouragement for those around us too. Um, anyway, that song is based on uh, a Bible verse. So I just wanna share that one. Uh, the song, uh, depending on what version you listen to by For King and Country, if you go on YouTube, there's a video and it actually has Joel Smallbone, um, He's uh, the lead singer in the group for King of Country. And then there's his brother that sings with him also, Luke. Um, but he reads this verse and uh, it's Psalm 121, verses one and two. I lift my eyes to the mountains. Where does my help come from? My help comes from the Lord, the maker of heaven and earth. So I read that and then I just, I was like, okay, God, what else, you know, there's verses about his help. And, um, so he led me to Psalm chapter 18. Um, I just want to read a few verses from there. Uh, verses 16 through 19 says, he reached down from on high and took a hold of me. He drew me out of deep waters. He rescued me from my powerful enemy, from my foes who were too strong for me. They confronted me on the day of my disaster, but the Lord was my support. He brought me into a spacious place. He rescued me because he delighted in me. And then verses 28 through 29. You, Lord, keep my lamp burning. My God turns my darkness into light. With your help, I can advance a troop with my God, I can scale a wall. And then um, chapter 18, verses 32 through 35. It is God who arms me with strength and keeps my way secure. He makes my feet like the feet of a deer. He causes me to stand on the heights. He trains my hands for battle. You make your saving help my shield. Your light, sorry, your right hand sustains me. Your help has made me great. And I just was like, wow, thank you, God, for leading me to those verses. Because, I mean, it's so powerful. Like, God is our help. He's our shield. And when it talks about how um, he rescued me from my powerful enemy, from my foes who were too strong for me, um, you know, and then it talks about he turns my darkness into light. So I've been through a lot of things in my life. Um, many of you know that I um, have dealt with anxiety and depression and things like that in my past. Um, God has helped me uh, pretty much maintain victory. And um, 
I do take some medicine, but my joy, my help, my strength comes from God and those that he places in my life that have been great encouragement, you know, words of encouragement, those that pray with me, pray for me. Um, and I try to be that for others too, because um, that's just who I am. I know the power of prayer. I know God's word and uh, how, how his love for us, you know, how he gives us strength. So yeah, I just wanted to share that with you tonight. Um, if you're going through something and um, just, pray, ask God, you know, he is our help, and um, the enemy that refers to, I mean, Satan is our enemy, Satan and the demons, and the Bible says that Satan is, um, he is out to steal, kill, and destroy, so he wants to steal our identity, uh, he doesn't want us to know who God created us to be, who we are in Christ, um, He's out to kill our dreams um, and uh, destroy our bodies, to be honest. Like, you know, and there's been a few times, a couple times uh, in my life, uh, probably over the past 10 years, there was a couple of times where I was in a super, super deep depression. Like, I didn't want to hurt myself and in my life myself, but I just felt like, uh, the world would be better off without me. Like, my family would be better off without me. Um, I just kind of wanted to just, like, fade and, you know, not be in the world. Um, it's crazy. But that was the devil. He was speaking negative things to me. He was causing me to be depressed. Um, but God, he's our righteous right hand. He lifted me up out of the pit. He, he, uh, he brought me out of the deep waters. And I'm so thankful um, for the power of prayer and for his word. And, you know, even when we don't feel like reading the Bible or, um, or praying, like I made myself do that. Like I even just opened up the Bible. I stood, I found one verse and I just, I put the Bible up to my chest and I was just like, God, help me, help me get this in my heart and like, let my mind just, just wash over me with your word. Um, and I spoke to you guys a little bit about music before, how it is so comforting. Um, it's just amazing. And I just love music with lyrics that are positive and encouraging and like make a difference in your life. Like we can listen to songs, but they're just, some songs are just great beats. You know, you like the beat and stuff, the bass, whatever. Um, but the lyrics are just empty. Like, what what good are they? They they don't encourage us to do good things or really encourage us um, to help us come out of depression or anxiety or um, some songs talk about things that are temporary um, highs or whatever you want to say. It might be something that temporarily makes us feel better. But um, in the long run, it's not. We still have our problems left to deal with uh, when reality comes back around, you know? So, um, but yeah, I just want to leave you with those words tonight. Um, that is out of uh, Psalm 121 was the first couple verses I read about our help comes from the maker of heaven and earth. And uh, then the others in Psalm chapter 18, starting with verse 16, if you want to look that up. And then the song recommendation um, is called Shoulders, and it's by For King and Country. So if you want to look that up on YouTube, I know it will greatly encourage you. It's helped me through times of um, loss of loved ones, and um, it's just a very encouraging song. So hope you have a great night. Thank you. God bless. Love you guys.